TFNN. Headline News Update. Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of Drizzly, Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, we've got uh, most of the U.S. indices trading to the upside. The only one that is not is the Dow Transports. They're off 33 points. The Dow's up 124. S&P 12. NASDAQ 156. Russell's up 3. Semis are up 17. Now, anywhere from 3 tenths of a percent to a half a percent to the upside. You've got gold up 14 bucks. That's up 8 tenths of a percent. Silver up 44 cents. That's up uh, 2 percent out there. And light sweet crude is up 16 pennies. She's trading at 7045. Let's go take a look at our nine panel market update chart. We begin by taking a look at the ES mini on the upper left hand side. What you'll see here is yesterday uh, price achieved the 1 to 1.618 A to B equals CD to the downside. I'm going to delete that now just simply so that uh, we don't have too much clutter there. And what uh, is needed in order to confirm a Gartley buy pattern, a buy the D point, is a bullish reversal candle. We don't have that as we speak right now. Key level of support to be watching and observing is 43.12. That is the bottom of the weekly profile. Close below that would say we have a change in trend inside the S&P 500. We've got the spot volatility well above the 50-day exponential moving average, always um, dangerous for the S&P 500 and the ES Mini. The NQ also achieving a 1 to 2, basically, A to B equals CD pattern to the downside. Uh, it also needs a bullish reversal candle to confirm it's by the D point. Price finding support at the bottom of its weekly profile. That's at 14802. Close below that on a weekly basis suggests a change in trend. The U.S. dollar index, it has generated an A to B equals CD to the upside out here. Um, and it still has a bearish uh, reversal candle. It's got a bearish separating line out there. So depending on how this ends at the, uh, the candle session, at the end of the trading session, we could see price pull back at least to 92.90. Gold right now, it is trading above the top of a brand new profile that is attempting to form. That's at 1776. We're trading at 1777. Now, I won't have confirmation of this profile until 6 o'clock this evening, but that uh, yesterday was the key reversal session. That confirmed a buy the D point. Uh, we didn't get that yesterday inside of uh, silver, but it looks like we're getting some action today. Now, in the case of silver, it's also trying to form a new profile, but it happens to be above price. And that's a bearish message that comes with it. Hey, folks, if you may hear the music in the uh, background, uh, stay tuned tuned for the Trader Said Show, but if you have to start your Tuesday, we want you to have a terrific Thanks for joining us. We'll see you again soon.